Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'll be showing off some Far Cry 4 gameplay and performance. So before I go any further, I'm just going to quickly go into the in-game settings. So playing at a resolution of 3840 by 2160. Now everything is maxed out. The only thing I've disabled is motion blur. I also have opted to use my uh, multi-sample anti-aliasing two times. I'm playing at 4K, so it's not really need to use too much anti-aliasing. Cod rays are enhanced first and trees uh, relief is also enabled. Now in the advanced tab, uh, field of views at maximum and uh, V-Sync of course is disabled. So let's see how we get on. Um, Far Cry 4, another part of the game, another one of the games from the franchise I actually really enjoyed. Um, I still preferred when I look in comparison, I still prefer five probably. Do not have to hide. I'm gonna try and uh, stab this guy. Try to sneak up on him. The longer you hide, the angry. That's a nice takedown. So um, this game is pretty demanding on the GPU in terms of the amount of heat it will make your GPU produce. As you can see, my GPU is pushing 372. What I am using the custom, um, I think it's the Galax BIOS, that's the one. Yeah, so the Galax BIOS 380 watt. Um, so the, normally the RTX 2080 Ti will cap out at 20, 280 watts. Uh, <laughs> that was a nice skill. But uh, with the uh, Galax BIOS, you'll go up to 380, so it just helps you. Stabilize your overclocks so when you're at high resolutions like 4K. As you can see, I'm running at 2100 uh, megahertz. So that's 2.1 gigahertz. Uh, let's try and sneak up on this guy as well. And um, when you when you tend to play at high resolutions, it does um, fluctuate quite a bit when the power limit's at the maximum. That's why you need the extra. You need the extra headroom just so you can uh, maintain these clock speeds. So anyway, that's all three of these guys taken out, so there's no one else looking for me. And uh, getting good performance at the moment. I remember, I think the graphics card I had when I first played this game was a GTX 980. So that had no chance of playing this at 4K. So seeing this at 4K now is quite nice. I'm gonna shoot this guy. It's a headshot. There's another guy over here as well. All three of them get headshots. No more fuss. Let's see if they got anything useful on them. Wow, this game is really stressing my GPU. 49 degrees, which is nothing in the grand scheme of things, but um, it's nice to see my uh, N60 Kraken X72 getting a workout. Uh, it's doing a good job, though. Okay, so I'm just gonna finish searching these guys and uh, make a move. I gotta make my way up the mountain now. Uh, a sprint. Game does look really, really nice though. Has to be said. I can't remember what year it came out. I know Far Cry 3 came out 20. 12 or 2013. I think this was two years after, so around about 2015 or 16 this came out. So it's getting on in age now, but it still looks really, really good. And um, if you want to play this game at 4K, it's still gonna it's still gonna need a beefy GPU. So I think to throw bait, you have to press G, possibly. I'm not too sure. I can't remember now. But I'm going to take these guys out individually. Just one more now. Right, these guys weren't really a challenge. 
I've got to be careful. I remember there being a bear around here somewhere, so I don't want to run into that. I'll just end up wasting all my bullets trying to keep it down. CPU usage is uh, quite average, around about 33% utilization on the i9 9900K, and um, plenty of headroom available. We probably will see an increase when we get to populated towns where there's more NPCs and things. Just taking in the graphics, it's still quite a good looking game even up to now. I still think Far Cry 5 is still better looking. Okay, let's keep on moving onwards. So we've got to this little village here. A few things I can pick up, so I'm gonna go and do that now. I'm gonna be able to break this. I guess not. Yeah. But I did have to use my weapon eventually to cut cut it rather than kick it. Take these throwing knives, these will become useful. Yeah, so it's all about doing stealth kills rather than alerting everyone. Let's see what's up here. Okay, nice. Okay, so it's quite well guarded. Try and find a good place to kill the first person. Uh, I'm tempted to try and throw a throwing knife from here, but I want to get a bit closer. I want to try and land without making too much noise. Alright. That's fine. Good thing is you can move the body as so I can just move it out of the way so no one will see him. Let's throw him in the in the bushes here. Now there's that guy over there. And that guy over here. I'm gonna try and do this as covertly as possible. It's just a bit more challenging that way. I could go in guns blazing, but Oh, almost got spotted there. Wonder who, who almost saw me. So there's two guys over there. So if I do run, I'm gonna have to be quick. Okay, so I made it across without being seen. This guy now. Just about got to him before I got seen. There's three guys there, and there's a leopard being held captive. You can release the creature to kind of create a distraction, but I'd rather do it without doing that, so. I'm gonna use these bushes as cover. I'm uh, gonna sneak up on this guy. I think he's seen something. So they just realized I'm here now. So I'm gonna release the uh, leopard. And kind of just let him run wild. But now they've got to deal with uh, uh, took him down. And I think there's just the leopard now. I think the leopard dealt with that one guy. I don't think there's anyone else remaining. So we kind of keep on moving now. Yeah, he did kill it. But I'm gonna make sure he doesn't kill me too. Nice. Just wanna get all up, everything I can before I go. Okay, let's keep moving. Spend a bit more, too much time in here. Loads of things to loot, though. Let's 
still maintaining way over 60 frames per second, which is always nice to see. Okay, let's dive down. Oh, there's something in the water. crazy guy man kidnapped a celebrity chef just so he could put on a good impression anyway I'm trying to make my way up this mountain now right I'm just doing that so I can collect skins early as possible because we will need them it's best to get as much as possible Always forget how to do this. It's an honor to meet you, son of Mohan. I'm amazed you made it all the way here on your own. Sabal is waiting for you near the tower. Okay. Well, the game does look really, really impressive at this part. Are you guys helping me? You're the son of Mohan Kale. You may not know it, but that name carries a lot of weight in Kirat, especially for the Golden Bar. Are those army guys still looking for me? Vegan men will stop at nothing to get you back. Damn. Some of Vegan's men managed to track us. They'll be here any second. We're in for a fight. Okay. Time to take out a few of Pagan men's goons. Here they come. Hold your ground. This is blocking up the window. Stay low. Take cover. Those guys out really quick. A few running down the mountain here as well. story so you do end up getting dug dug out of the snow <laughs> I 
You're a tough man to kill, brother. That's a good thing, right? So with the uh, cutscenes, they always seem to lock to 60 frames per second. If you're wondering why um, that happened, I'm not too sure. How did you know to find me? He saw Bacon's chopper nearby. He's never down this far south, and I wanted to know why. Lucky for you, we were in the area when we got Darpan's text. Well, we're here. Welcome to Banapur. Home of the Golden Path. Who's this? Where's Darpan? He didn't make it. This is Ajay Gale. Mohan's son. Let me understand. Darpan's dead? Hmm? And you brought me this. I'm not involved in, in whatever this is. I'm just looking for Lakshmana. We're in the middle of a fucking war. We don't have time for tourists. What was I supposed to do? Just leave him there? I'm sorry, brother. Amita's a little touchy. I'll talk to her. As for Lakshmana, it sounds like it could be a temple or shrine. But if that's the case, it's in the north. The north is enemy territory, and we can't get you there. Not yet. Go and clear your head. Come find me when you're ready. Hmm? So finally, you kind of get to walk around. You're not on work rails anymore. So anyway, I'm gonna go and uh, get some rest. Can't get in there yet. I'm gonna go and get some rest first. And, uh, see if I can do a mission. Oh dear. Okay. Try and do a mission. Namaste. Namaste. Guess that's hello or good morning. floods the airways and we have to endure his bullshit. Enough is enough! I told him to climb up the old bell tower, take over the transmitters, hijack the broadcast locally. Except... I can do it. Way to step up, brother. There's nobody guarding it, but it's a tricky climb. Promise me you won't fall. I promise. I won't.
Messiah. What the hell just happened? Shine upon you all. 